Throughout history, numerous terrifying execution methods were employed to punish prisoners for their crimes. Different cultures and countries developed their own techniques, and various individuals faced the wrath of emperors and tyrannical rulers. For example, Henry VIII altered the laws of England to permit the execution of people by boiling them alive for poisoning. This gruesome fate befell a man and a woman accused of such a crime, instilling fear in the Tudor king. One particularly bizarre and brutal execution and torture method that emerged during the Thirty Years' War was the Scheiden trunk, or the Swedish drink. What made this method so extraordinarily barbaric? The Scheiden trunk involved forcing a victim to swallow large amounts of repugnant liquid. German victims of Swedish soldiers during the Thirty Years' War devised this method. It was employed by various soldiers and civilians to coerce peasants and townspeople into surrendering food, money, and animals to the enemy. This method was infamous for its cruelty and sadism. The Swedish drink involved laying the bound soldier on the ground inserting a wooden wedge into his mouth and pouring a bucket full of disgusting liquid manure into his belly. This mixture, known as the Swedish drink, contained various repulsive materials, including human excrement and animal waste. Victims were forced to ingest this deadly concoction, which could easily kill them. Substances such as urine and liquid manure were also used. This method was widespread throughout towns in southern Germany. In every instance of the Swedish drink, the victims were restrained or held down, gagged, and forced to swallow the boiling hot liquid using a pipe or funnel. Sometimes, it resembled a dirty form of waterboarding, but the victim had to drink the vile mixture. The Swedish drink caused numerous problems, including excruciating stomach pain, illness, and severe infection. Many of the liquids were indigestible, leading to intense pain as the bowels struggled to process them. To intensify the suffering, torturers would place a wooden board on the victim's stomach, stand on it, or beat the victim with weapons. In extreme cases, victims were even stabbed in the stomach. The Swedish drink was a horrifying and lethal torture method that often resulted in death due to the diseases it caused. Thank you for watching.